All right, so we're arriving to work here on a fine, fine fall cold morning. It's drippy and wet and cold. And I wanted to show something to my viewers. This is my modern micro mystery van. And you can see the rear end is sagging a little bit. That's because I'm using it as a truck, as a van, storage container. It is full to the gills of Renault parts. That's right. Uh, engines, transmissions, seats. Uh, I think I have a door in there. A lot of heavy stuff. Probably a thousand, maybe 1,500 pounds. And look it. The van's barely squatting in the back. I can tell when I drive it. It feels pretty heavy. But these little vans are incredible. I'll show you the back side here. Carburetors, alternators, generators. Uh, lots of heavy stuff. Gas tank in there. Uh, guy was cleaning out his garage, was gonna scrap it all. I thought, oh, I'm sure I can find somebody that'll find good use for it, or I can. Again, it's all Renault parts. Caravel, 4CV, and the heater core, exhaust manifold, radiators, trim, bumpers, hubcaps, and then we got our puppy dog. So, pretty useful little van. There's a, I think that's an 1100 engine. I'm super excited about that. Complete. Nice score. It's gonna get scrapped, so. A little van is is uh, proving its worth today. Uh, between the windshield wiper, the defroster, I have a heating seat pad on that side, the dog. We can stay warm and dry and defrosted in this wet, cold, rainy weather. But it's super fun. Love my little van. And it's practical and useful too. Surprised there aren't more of these around. I do understand the safety concerns and the, uh, what do they call it? The bumper probably is, well, wouldn't withstand a five mile an hour crash, but it does haul my stuff, gets good mileage, and is very useful and it's fun to drive. So there we are. It's a cold, rainy fall morning, like I said, but we're enjoying the comforts of our little van. All right, have a great day. I just wanted to check in, let everybody know that the van isn't just sitting around just for looks. It's being used. <laughs> Thanks for watching.